let's go get some bait. I've got some bait already in the tank up at the car, but I'm gonna try and get some bluegill here at this creek, which I've never been here before. But I've been eyeballing it for years. And I guess today's the day. Oh look, we got a hole right here. It's full of fish. Oh, I already got a hit, there we go. Hooked up. There we go, y'all. There's the first bluegill. Not a big one, but he'll do for a lot of bait, especially on a day when we got a lot of driving to do. Take what we can get. There we go. That might be a bass. Nope, that's just a feisty bluegill right there, man. Okay guys, two down, seven to go. There we go. One after the other now. There we go. That's some of my favorite bait. and One of the most beautiful fish in the world right there. That's amazing. Love it. It's like seven or eight. Doing good. Okay, last one. Here we go. Pumpkin seed, awesome. Big one too. All right guys, that's gonna do it for this bait fishing trip. We are now gonna go out to the big river and try to find monster fish. But look at that beautiful, beautiful fish right there. Let's go. Bait on this far side will be another bullhead. I'm also going to canoe him out to the top of the hole. Pumpkin seed. Live drum. Put my camera on, that's why I have circle hooks. We'll see if he's still there. Thought for sure he was. Oh yeah, there's something there, man. Yeah, let's see what we got here. Oh. Okay. on that bluegill that we put out less than five minutes ago. It's got weight. Took about five minutes, y'all. Been a long day. This is awesome. Flathead already. Good morning. All right, I'm gonna attempt to just get him up. Oh, he's hooked good. Yeah, he's hooked well. Awesome. All right, first fish of the day. Got about an hour to full sunset. It's awesome out here. This guy hit it like a freight train. Really strong guy. Pretty fish. <laughs> yeah, he was ready. Caught a flathead there. Could be a gar. 
for a turtle. Fish on. Uh oh. Fish on. It might be big. It feels big. Oh. Maybe it's not. I don't know what's going on. What is it? Another flathead? Another flathead. Small one. Really small. He ate that perch. Second flathead of the day. Another little flathead. This one's smaller, but a lot of fun. Cool fish. <laughs> awesome. Okay, same pumpkin seed going back out. Okay guys, we're all the way out here in the bush, but that's uh, that's two flatheads so far and just a, I don't know, 20 minutes out here, so good deal. Let's uh, keep them coming. Here in a minute I'm going to switch to uh, bluegill since that's what they're biting on, but I like these bigger baits just to give me a shot. Although we know a big one can hit a small bait. It's a good time out here. Gotta be fish on. This just got doubled. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's a fish on. Don't know what he is. I don't think he's very big. Feels like another flathead. What is it? It's frustrated. That's another flathead, y'all. That's the third one tonight. Barely, barely, barely hooked. Let's see if we can get him up. We got him. No problem. Okay, guys. There's another flathead. Got somebody else pulling up here. This sucks. Anyways, fun fish. Try and tighten up the line. Going a little too far. See what happens. See what happens when I do tighten up the line. You know what I mean? See if it freaks out. Maybe. 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 A lot of weight on there. Might be a big fish. It's something heavy. I think it's a flathead that didn't know. I may have just been my bait. Just my bait, wow. Did I catch something on that? Look at that. That bullhead. I caught a little flathead. Another little flathead. Wow. Hey guys, he's so small. I uh, I really didn't know. He ate a bullhead half his size, maybe a third. <laughs> that little fish. Fun fish shot. Put him back. Good morning, everyone. 
these lines are crossed. This one keeps getting bent over. Yeah, we'll see what we got, guys. Something heavy. It may just be the weeds of the, uh, since it's been out in the river all night. Still haven't seen them. Oh man, that's a big old turtle. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Look at this, y'all. That's a really big one, too. There we go. Okay, I'm scared to hold up a gar. Very, very violent fish when they thrash with those teeth. One of the smallest ones I've ever caught. But really a, a very, very cool and beautiful fish. I know this one's muddy, but uh, anyways, I'm gonna let him go. Four flatheads, one turtle, one gar. It's forever fishing, I guess. All right, guys, that's gonna do it. It was an interesting exploratory fishing trip. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hit the subscribe button, like this video, leave me a comment. Again, just thanks so much for coming on this adventure with me here on Chasing Moby Dick. You guys have a great day. See ya.